Well, many of you are probably planning your Super Bowl party, but before you load the menu with all your favorite foods, you might want to look into some healthier Super Bowl spreads. We've got Courtney Ferreira, the founder of Real Food Court, joining us with some healthier options. Thank you yes. so much for coming Thanks in. Thanks for having me. You want to splurge a little bit because it's we a do. fun, exciting time. You're having Absolutely. people over, but you can splurge a little healthier. Exactly. And really, the biggest mistake I find people make when they're trying to make healthy eating changes is they do so well during the week. And when the weekend comes, when it's a party, they do that all or nothing. <laughs> and you're doing yourself a disservice, Not honestly. Good. Not good. So I really remind people that you want to eat nutritious food, but make sure it tastes good. Yes, that's really. huge. Because yes. a lot of times you eat healthy and you, you think, why am I doing this? Right. This isn't worth right. it. And that's what leads you to going crazy on the weekend. And that's so. what leads us to all of this here. Yes. You're telling me this is a healthier version over here. Yes, so instead of doing normal fried chicken and waffle, I did buffalo chicken salad, so we get the buffalo taste in there. Yes. And I use Kodiak cake uh, mix. I actually love this mix. It has whole grains and protein, so you're not getting so much sugar and refined carbohydrates. Uh-huh. So that's what we have there. Should I try it? If you want to, go okay. for it. Okay, and so the chicken dip, what do you have in here that makes it's, this not so bad? So I do, I just shred up some chicken breast, or you can do like a rotisserie chicken, and then a little mayo sour cream fat actually satisfies you and mm -hmm. stops you from wanting more and then just some red hots buffalo sauce. And I feel sauce. like I'm eating something special with the waffles exactly. too. Exactly. Yes. You still so get it feels like a tree. That. Yes. That's good. I like yes. that. Awesome. I would have never made that too. That's good. What do you have here? Here roasted chickpeas. So this is a really good like just when you're sitting and snacking, instead of like chowing down on chips and getting all that carbohydrate, yeah. which is gonna weigh you down, just chickpeas, you rinse them, dry them, roast them okay. at 400 degrees for around 30 minutes, let them cool in the oven and whatever spices you'd like. And that's kind of nice because when you're watching a game, sometimes I feel like you're eating and you're not yeah, realizing exactly. how much you're eating. So this exactly. is something that, that's a little healthier exactly. and it tastes good too. What do you have right here? So here we have mini chili bowls. So I love this, you know, Super Bowl is around Loading dinner time. Up here, yeah. <laughs> it's around dinner time and again you don't want to load up on chips. So if you do something that's more like an entree. So crock pot chili, throw in veggies like greens, people don't even notice. Is that what you have over here? Yep, are, some right chilies, here. some green chilies. And that makes it a and little more filling Yep, too. and I'll add spinach, I'll add carrots, mm -hmm. and then I paired it with <laughs> some cornbread muffins and again using a mix that actually has protein in it, yes. lots of whole grains, not too sweet. And I think sometimes we'd be afraid of the muffins thinking it wasn't yeah. healthy, but there are healthier versions. Yes. We're not saying that exactly. this is good for you, but it can be it's, a healthier exactly. option. Exactly, exactly. It's, it's healthier and it tastes good. Like that is the yeah. key. When you're tr eating a diet food or a health food, and having something boring. that fills you up. And then we've got the chips yes. and dip, but what so kind of dip do you have here? Traditional dip, we did spinach artichoke dip, so you get the veggies in there. Honestly, I mean, you get a little veggies, it's still gonna taste good. We'll Plenty of, you know, fat in there, so it's gonna be really satisfying. And I actually use some bean chips instead oh, of corn chips. And they're really good too, they taste yeah. great. Yeah. Thank you so much, thank and thank you. you for the sandwich. I can't yeah. believe Jonathan isn't running over here. Must be busy <laughs> over there in the 